the World Bank is assisting the government in its uh, effort to double the GDP by 2025, the latest, and to become a high income uh, country within a decade after that. These are the targets. So, we've been tackling some of the core areas. Firstly, we looked at education. Today, we are taking up the ending of poverty. What we remember is that Sri Lanka in 1949 was the leading nation. Japan had far more potential, but was destroyed. They knew how to rebuild our potential, but where is Sri Lanka? Therefore, President Michael Pala Sirisena has got the mandate to form a national government and we have formed a national government to go ahead and deliver the things to the people. We have been having many programs on ending poverty. We have had many programs on rural development. We have many programs, similar ones. And the one day I did the assessment to see what went to the people and what went behind the bureaucracy. What all we have created is a large bureaucracy at the village level. So are these effective? Are we just holding and giving money to the poor while the country's economy is growing and the rich are becoming richer? and we are subsidizing the poor. We've got to break through. First thing is to get out of this South Asia mentality and look at the East Asian models. High level of growth which requires manufacturing, IT, tourism, all the culture. Then only with the rural economy also they go. Modernize the rural economy. What we have to do. Then work on what we do in the villages. Are the present programs Really effective. I also have land and I am of agriculturalist in that sense, but I the land will be a lot of. But I don't want to resort to any help from the government for the simple reason I have sufficient capital like many others. There was a difference between the ordinary poor farmer and me. I have capital, he has a part of So, how do we help him? Do we help him by giving him capital or do we help him by giving him something? Modernize the economy so he can go to the market and sell, decide where to sell, or are we sending it through a bureaucratic government? In the case of the cities, uh, poverty or is also tied up to education. Improving my education, improving my education opportunities, and having better and better um, employment prospects. So these are the issues from when we, I mean, when I came to politics in 77. Majority of the country is having electricity. Most of the schools were undeveloped. We've gone past all that. We've done what we have to do South Asian wise. Now we have to decide how we get ahead and the new approach we take.